and welcome back to Let's Play Contact. Hmm. Let's actually go somewhere this episode. Instead of heading to the uh, next actual area, instead let's head over to... No, wait, that's right. Let's head over to Bamboo Island. We got a bit of a side quest we should take care of before heading back to the main quest. And the first thing that involves is taking a nap. No, I am not going to save. I just saved. And we will not play with Mochi yet. Hmm. Anyways, let's go find some bamboo. Hmm. 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 Apparently only one guy lives on this island. Well, it is a pretty small island, but still, you would expect at least some more people to live here. That is some big bamboo. Hmm. Too bad we can't take it with us. Anyways, let's go see who lives in here. People with a drum machine, apparently. What do you have to say, Grandpa? How dare he try to help people? Sure, why not? Screw your grandson. We're gonna be the thief of the family. I don't know if that's a real thing, but okay. Alright, so we gotta head back to Caldoxia. Can't do anything here yet. He wants us to find him some, some kind of... thing. I think he said it was a spice. Well, that's where we're gonna find it anyways. So then, back to Caldoxia we go. All the way back here. Oh, I should re remember to replenish my uh, potions at some point. How many potions do I have? Surprisingly a lot. But I should probably get more anyways. Because the next area is kind of tough. No, we will not save. Mochi, go away. I do not want to speak to you right now. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, we've arrived. Alright, let's head back to the spice shop. Because that's where we need to go to get the, uh, thing the thief wants. But first things first. Oh, he didn't drop any meat. Oh well, I was hoping to get some meat to uh, practice cooking with. But nope. That goat didn't want to drop any. Isn't that right, well? The well says water. I, yeah, I need to get more water. But anyways, off to the spice shop. Actually, wait, uh... No, I thought we picked up some, some uh, sushi in that last dungeon, but we didn't. We'll get some sushi soon enough, though. Because remember, the mayor kind of wants sushi. Oh. Thank you. Well, he gave us some spice. Unfortunately, he won't let us back there. Sure, we'll use a key to open it. I think that's just more spice. Nope, it's Blue Eyes Volume 1. And we lost Karma from that because we kind of stole from him. Uh, where is Blue Eyes? There it is. Yeah, basically it's just one continuous storyline. Each book is like a par it's not even a paragraph, it's like a sentence. Anyways, is he out of the way now? Nope, I need to get back there. I see. Well, what happens if I just, uh, murder him? No one will mind, right? Surprisingly, we didn't lose karma for that. Odd. Anyways. Let's keep going. We want to head back to that one room where he was trapped in. That's where we're going to find the things we need. Also, these guys are running away from us now. They're not going to attack us on sight anymore because we are so much stronger than they are. And they're surprisingly smart for... bug... things. Not sure what they're supposed to be. Anyways, we want to look back here. But first things first, let's murder these things. But yeah, these guys are pretty tough. 
if we had tried to take them on when we first met them, we probably wouldn't have been able to kill them. Ow. Okay, stop defending. I just want to kill you to get, get you out of my way. Come on. One. Oh, come on. Stop defending. Thank you. Alright, uh, where is the spice? I think it's on that shelf. There it is. They're clothes. We came all this way for clothes. Also, we can, uh, teleport back to the ship in here. Can we in here? Nope, we have to get out of this, of this, uh, spice rack. Go away. I don't want to fight you right now. Okay, I was going to say, fine, I'll fight you. But nope, he left. Oh, I haven't shown off the b balloon decal yet, have I? Well, basically all you do is... Oh, right. Heal it. Stick it on. And then... Stick it on. And then blow when it... Okay, blow... Now. There we go. And it does a lot of damage if you can blow it up all the way. Which isn't that hard. So yeah, that's actually really good for clearing out enemies. Maybe I shouldn't have wasted it. Oh well. I'll just recharge it when we get we have I'm just gonna recharge it uh when we get back to the ship anyways. Luckily that guy doesn't seem too pissed that we killed him. Of course he's not looking at us anymore, but our karma's still plenty high. So we don't have to worry about townspeople hurting us. Actually what is my karma at? Yeah, we're fine. We're at 44 karma. We are fine in terms of karma. I could murder this entire town, and I would still be in the positive. In fact, no, we're not going to murder everyone. Also, I would use a sticker, but we're literally like a screen away. So might as well just walk back. Give me a chance to kill the goat again. Oh, he dropped meat this time. Nice. All right, back to Bamboo Island we go. Oh wait, I should get more, uh, recharge my decal. Thank you. All right then, back to Bamboo Island we go. We got the old man's clothes. Not sure why he wants clothes, but okay. Aren't they just like a spice or something? Mochi will play later. <laughs> Alright, back to Bamboo Island we are. And now let us give him his clothes. And then he will teach us how to be a thief. <laughs> or not. I don't know how to read minds, but okay. Well then, we have a letter to deliver. Apparently, thievery involves postal service. Not sure why, but he didn't exactly tell us who to give it to. But we'll figure it out pretty easily. Also, I guess is right next to Bamboo Island. I probably could have swam. Actually, probably not. It still looks pretty far. No mochi. Later. Don't worry. Alright. Now we want to head to the bazaar. Mostly because that's where all the people in Aegis actually live. No one lives out in the desert. Except the snakes. But nobody likes the snakes. They're kind of mean. And they kind of want to kill me. Also coconut. I'll take that. I'll deal with you some other time. Alright, uh, Bazaar is right up here. That's right. Ooh, coconut. Nope, no more coconuts. Okay. Anyways, the person we want to give the letter to is that one lady who yell yelled at us late earlier. Um, what's in that letter? Sure, why not? 
isn't he like old enough to be your father? Okay, I can't kill her. All right, well, we delivered the letter. Time to head back to Bamboo Island again. All right, oh, I should get another ship decal before I go to bed. Don't want to forget that, because that's kind of really helpful. It's not important, but it's just really helpful. All right, we delivered the old man's letter. Not sure exactly why he wanted us to give that letter to that random person, but we did. What do you mean the bed can't be used in open sea? Mochi, later. Okay, one. There you go, Mochi. Okay, see you later. Yeah, this quest involves a lot of travel time. All right, now that we have the letter delivered, let's go see if the old man will teach us how to be a thief now. I'm not even looking at him. Yes. Oh. Okay, that's easy. All right, um, pick it. Okay, we didn't even start, but okay. Well then, a kid half our age is a better lockpick than us. And then Grandpa died. And then got abducted by aliens? Okay. Well, Grandpa's dead. That was sudden. But, but you were gonna be a doctor. Hey, <laughs> I'm gonna stab you once you grow up. In fact, no, we can't kill him now to stop him later. Alright, anyways, we got the Shadow Thief costume. Yes. It also makes us look like a vampire for some reason. Anyway, Shadow Thief costume. It gives us basically the ability to pick locks and to steal stuff. Obviously. Picking locks is also really helpful in this game. It also gives us a massive HP penalty. And I think it gives, a car gives us a karma penalty too. No karma's the same. Okay. But yeah, the thing about the Shadow Thief is that it is extremely useful, but... It just gives you so little HP. Well, whatever. Before we end, there is one more thing I want to do, though. Except for the fact that the uh, C-Nav is out of order. Let's go talk to the professor. Maybe he'll fix it for us. Sure. He'll be fine. Nah. Mm. 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 But, but I want to leave. I have more side quests to do. Oh, never mind, he's fixed. All right, now we want to head back to Fort Eagle. Because there's still one more costume we have to get. And then we'll be done with our wardrobe. Isn't that right, Mochi? Mochi said yes. You all heard it. Mm. Alright then. Now that we're back at Fort Eagle, remember that one fisherman who wanted some, uh, bait? Well, that was like a few weeks ago, but we found him, uh, uh we found a worm earlier. Mm. Also, there's a new guy here. What do you want? Oh. Okay. Sure, you can buy them. You can sell this guy your empty cans. It's a pretty useful way to get rid of him. It's better than nothing, anyways. Anyways, also there are more people around here ever since we uh, blew up the military base.
I want... No, we can't kill these people. Yes. Fine. Oh, okay, fine. We might bring you the king once we find him. But anyways, we want to head back to that fisherman now. Bunnies. Slimes. Goats. Random person standing in the middle of the woods. What are you doing there? I don't remember you. Oh, hi, Bridget. Okay. Hmm, you don't say. Actually, what is my intelligence? Uh, uh, yeah, I'm not even remotely intelligent. Basically, there are girlfriends in this game. She's one of them. I'll be recruiting them later. Because you kind of need really high stats for them. In fact, what are my stats? Uh, not high enough for any of them. Got it. Also, it is easier coming back when you're a lot stronger, just because all the enemies run from you. So you don't have to bother with them. Well, we never had to bother with the slimes, but anyways. Oh wait, Snake still wants to fight. And then the snake died. Oh hey, cows. Actually, I wonder if I can steal from them. Nope, let's try again. Come on, carry steal from the cow. Yes, we stole his milk. Not sure how that works, but we can steal milk from cows. Oh crap, that's not what I meant to do. Well anyways. Sure you can have it. Oh my crap, that's a big fish. Oh hi! That's a really derpy looking... fish. Um... Thanks for that? Well, we just led a man to his death, but more importantly, we got the final costume. Sure, why not? I don't think we have a fishing rod though, do we? Yeah, we don't have a fishing rod, so we can't fish yet. Oh well, I'll figure- I'll find one later. But anyways, basically you can fish for items with this costume. It's pretty useful, and there are some really good items you can get with it. But first, I am going to kill a snake. Because I feel like it. Oh, we got a decal from that. Well anyways, I think we'll end the episode here. So, next time on Let's Play Contact, we actually get back to the main plot. Especially since we've- we've pretty much done- that we pretty much finish our clothes shopping for the game. We have every single costume now. Oh. No, sorry. Ooh. I don't think I have a. I think I have roses on me. Shh. No. I need to save my flowers for later. So then, till next time. There are sheep here. <laughs>